Hey there, it's off floor, Chucky. So, you know, there's stats and figures for everything, right? Like, weird things. <clears throat> Guys, you know, how many people die every year from a coconut falling on your head or something like that? Or how many whales eat a human or whatever? Okay. So, there's all kinds of stats and figures for weird things. But there's, stat, you know, there's weird things that happen all the time that I'm sure that probably no records are kept. Like, just as an example, here's, a, here's one. Okay. So, say as an example, you're about to have sex with a woman and whatever. And, uh... This is a new partner, okay? First time, and all of a sudden, you're, you're about to do it and all that, and then you get a call or a text or something, you see it or get it somehow that informs you that your mother died, your dad, whatever, a very close family member. Somebody in your immediate family just died, and you're just about to have sex, okay? So where's the numbers on that? What are the odds? What are we saying here? Hmm? We're saying it's possible, it's probably... One in several millions, it happens, happens to a few people, it's happened to one, what, what, what's the number? Okay, well, let's throw some twists in it, maybe. Let's say, uh, let's say this is the first time you've had sex, particularly in maybe three, four years. Huh? You haven't had sex in, in quite a long time. You're about to have sex for the first time in a long time with a new partner. You're really excited about it, and you find out your mother's died. Okay, now, let's just talk about this for a second here, okay? Probably pretty sure, and you would agree that doesn't happen that often maybe you know maybe who knows how maybe once and to anybody but but the thing is this is that you know although we can laugh and joke about it because you know uh you're, you know you're about to have sex uh and it's kind of funny in that sense and that you know you get the message that somebody dies that part's not the funny part but the, you know the thing is is that um you know having sex is not a job it's not an occupation we all understand that you know what i mean but imagine now if you were uh you're at work i'm sure millions is happened millions of times to people at work who get a call get a notification that somebody's died and you know and you're in the middle of let's say you're working at the mcdonald's and you're working the drive through and uh, all of a sudden you've, you've got an order that you're just putting together right to hand out okay chances are really really high that you might just, you know, kind of throw those fries in the bag and complete the order and just hand it out the window or something. You know what I mean? Like, you might, you might at the very least just kind of finish your last order, right? If you're flying an airplane, okay, I don't think you're just going to just take your hands off the wheel and say, that's it, I'm out of here, throw a parachute on, jump out the window, right? I got to go, my mama died. I don't think you're going to do that. You're probably going to land the damn plane, okay? You know, and and there's, there's a million other jobs that are just like that. You probably, you know, because you're already... You focused on what you were doing before that your job so it's kind of like autopilot kind of thing right so here's the thing you know you might say well sex is different sex is totally different like, i mean you you should just stop that right now and 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 you know go do what you got to do you know what i mean okay i get that i get that sex is not like it's like your occupation your job or something but uh it's still something that needs to be done i mean uh you know, I mean, if anything, my, my folks, you know, try to bring me up to, you know, if you're going to start a job, you better finish the job. You should finish the job. I mean, that's just good, solid advice, right? So, you know, so, uh, well, so what did you do? So what should you do? Well, I cried and screwed. I cried and screwed. <laughs> my mom is gone. Does that feel good for you? Whoa. This is terrible. I gotta get back home because my mama just died. Hang on a second. I'm almost there. I'm almost there. <laughs> Are you coming? Are you coming yet? I don't really care. I'll be honest with you. I really don't care. Just need to finish. Go. God. All right. Listen, I gotta go. Yeah. yeah I gotta go. All right. Well, you take care now. Maybe I'll see you again. I'll call you. Maybe afterwards, you know. All right. South Lord Juggy, help. Bye.